along the desolate stretch of desert marking the border between Jordan and Syria. A car bomb exploded in Rakban, a military zone lying some 300 kilometers northeast of Jordan's capital, heavily guarded by patrols and drones. Marked here in red is the makeshift camp that houses some 50,000 Syrian asylum seekers. The blast took place just a few hundred meters away. Jordanian armed forces have said that at 5.30 a.m. local time, at a sand barrier near the Syrian refugee camp in the Rakban area, a bombing took place by a car laden with explosives and resulted in the martyrdom and injuring of a number of members of the Jordanian armed forces. It's the deadliest attack on Jordan's border in years and the second to hit the country in recent weeks. A fortnight ago, five Jordanian intelligence agents were killed when a gunman stormed an office near a Palestinian refugee camp north of Amman. The growing violence has led some to question whether the country can block spillovers of conflict from war-ravaged Syria next door. Jordan is a staunch ally of the United States and a member of the US-led campaign against the Islamic State group, which controls large parts of neighboring Syria and Iraq. After the outbreak of war in Syria in 2011, over 600,000 Syrian refugees fled to Jordan. Security fears prompted the pro-Western Kingdom to seal almost all its border crossings with Syria in 2013 and admit a limited number of asylum seekers. The move was widely criticized, but Jordanian officials say Islamic State group fighters are trying to slip into Jordan by passing themselves off as refugees.